All right, so these things are nuts. Look at the, what? All right, I was at my local fish store, right? And um, I saw these guys, they were um, in the tank. The tank wasn't labeled. I didn't know what, what they were. But I just thought they got in more flounders and then I looked more closely and then these things were like five times as long as the ones that I picked up before. It's the same store that I got um, the flounders in my last video at. Um, and yeah, these things are crazy. So after doing some research, I kind of concluded that these guys are freshwater soles or one of the workers, uh, I think he called them uh, tongue fish or tongue flounders. Which makes sense, they, you know, do look like a tongue, but I got two that they had, and they're crazy. Look at these guys, I have not seen these before. Um, they're insane. Um, there's not that much, like, care info on them. I, I'm just gonna go off the assumption that they are very similar to the other freshwater flounders that I have, and all of them are hiding right now. Like, there's one right there, I don't know if you can see it, but the eyes are sticking up right there, but, yeah, I mean, so far the other flounders have been doing good, so I decided to get these guys. Um, I don't think these guys will eat the other flounders. I think their mouths are too small for that. Um, but these guys are crazy. Look at them. They call these guys freshwater soles. I assume that's kind of like, you know, the freshwater flounders. You know, they aren't really freshwater. But these guys are nuts. Anyways, they've been in the bag for a while. They've been acclimating. Punk uh, I, I uh, you know, punctured a few holes and yeah, let's add them to the tank. I've been getting a lot of these rare oddball fish and there's more to come so if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button so you don't miss these upcoming unusual and amazing fish in these next videos and yeah, these guys are gonna be a pain to get out of the bag there you go yep and just like the flounders they will bury themselves which means I probably won't see them uh, 80 percent of the time but that's all good these guys are crazy oh my goodness what yeah they're like uh if i had to compare them to anything else they're just like kind of like a whip tail catfish you know um not exactly but it kind of reminds me of a whip tail catfish there's another flounder in the back let me see it uh yeah very the small the little dot on the back wall that's a that's one of the flounders but yeah, I have uh, eight flounders and two freshwater soles. These guys are insane. Well, that's all for today's video. I just wanted to show you guys these guys. I definitely will do an update video on them. And uh, I'll, do up I'll, I'll do an update video on this tank as well because I'm sure you all want to um, see more of the flounders. Uh, that's what a lot of people have been telling me. So I I'm glad you guys like them and I hope you guys like these freshwater soles as well. Again, more videos of oddball fish coming up. So if you are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, like the video, do all that stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next one.